really enjoyed the training. Sorry, I'm a mess today. It's just, um, but uh, I've actually been through the person-centered planning training twice, and uh, I've I've got so many notes and so many things written down. And then uh, yesterday was my son who has a traumatic brain in, injury. Um, uh, 25 years ago, that happened, and <clears throat> Sarah, who you just saw. Uh, conducted that meeting with us and it was absolutely amazing and I saw Luke do things that I I didn't even know he could do I saw an attitude that I didn't know uh, he could portray um, sometimes but what it's done is it's changed my life it's given me a purpose too because I feel like I want to get this out to as many people as I can and share the wonderful news of person-centered planning training and it's definitely changing and going to continue to change the life that my son leads and I'm very proud of him and very happy that I got to meet all of you. I really enjoyed the training. I, I, I do a, a extended family home and I have two guys that live with me and implementing this for them would be great. I learned a lot from this person Center for People Earth Planning. Center for People Planning. Um, uh, I got to lead my own meeting uh, not too long ago. Um, it's great. I was out of my come out of my hermit shell and <laughs> learned a lot from this meeting that we trained, the training that we had. Yeah, you know, I was like amazed that I could lead my own whole meeting and everybody was like so impressed that I got to lead it and I had a lot of staff that just surprised, that I surprised a lot of people from leading my own meeting and sticking to my agenda and Yeah, good job. Yeah, thank you guys. Well, I have been, you know, a trainer in leadership in special education for many years. And I've been hoping and dreaming for this to happen for uh, young adults to be able to move and have a voice and have a dream and have choices. And with this training, and I've listened to all of the ones that I couldn't attend, I listened to them and watched all the videos and was uh, participating in the Charting of Life course. And it's just wonderful to know that now we've got a plan forward to be able to be uh, community advocates for these young people who need to have a voice and need to have a, have dreams and, and have purpose and to live a good life. And it's a, it's, it's a long time coming and I'm so happy that it's happening now and I'll be able to be involved in it. Here we go. I, um, you, you know, th this has been fantastic. And talk about a circle because on, on here tonight, um, I was at Josh's first meeting that he ran. And and I have sat with him through several of the, the trainings and I have watched the growth and the confidence that, that comes from being able to express your dreams and the directions you want to go. Yesterday, I was at Luke's meeting as a friend and and to see the impact of, of what two hours of mapping does for a person um, is amazing. Um, Brandy, who has been on here uh, off and on through, through the weeks here, um, I was at her meeting where that was the first time ever she ran her meeting and the impact that it had on on her and and the team and i just uh we had to have a special meeting today in regards to some things and they, they weren't the most pleasant but she ran that meeting she she called that meeting she had some concerns and she brought those concerns to to them to see that growth um, Josh is usually sitting with me here. Um, you know, Josh has been doing his thing for a long time. We, we, we have believed in person centered for a long time, but even him sitting through these has given him more confidence to, to speak out. He hasn't had a meeting yet. He, he, and he ran his meeting several months ago, but 
What I've seen him do is use the tools that he's learned here to run his own Poo Patrol staff meetings with, with support um, from, from Sarah and myself and, and others. So it, it's giving the power to people and that's and allows them to dream. And that's a great thing. Um, the biggest takeaway for me from this training is I am a ZD service coordinator in Omaha. I have absolutely enjoyed learning about the person-centered planning even more. Um, I think that this is going to open so many doorways to so many of my participants. I feel like it actually will give them a larger say and a voice in what they want out of life and how they want to achieve those goals. So I just want to thank everybody that was in our group for such an amazing four weeks. This training has been great. It's really taught me how to um, create a circle of support and like just learn how to be in a self advocate, a better self advocate, and be more social and just become an overall happier, more successful version of myself. So, thank you so much. I guess I'm a born natural advocate, I don't know. But I had to have help along the way. And uh, I just want to thank each and every one of you guys for what you do for people. And all the team, David, Ruthie, Mark, uh, uh, all you guys, Anne and Mary Angus, Thanks for doing this because it's about time Nebraska has this. So people's voices get heard and shared. They're, it's too much oftentimes that people are relied on what they can't do, what they can't learn. I know people can do this. I know if people that don't have a voice, they they also can voice their opinion. They do, they do mean a lot to people. So I just, this is a passion of mine and I'll just advocate for the rest of my life. So, and I care about people. So, and I want yeah. to tell Mark, thanks for what you've done for me. I just, I can't say thank you enough, Ruthie, the whole team. It's awesome to finally have this in Nebraska.